Hello, I am Mike of Neil Enough Dice, and this is Minecraft. Here we are in my uh, temple, and this is um, the area I've been trying to clean out. Seen from above, oh, there's, there's monsters that are trying to kill me, which is being slightly irritating. Well, I'm trying to do a video. Anyway, you can see how much I've taken it down, but also how much there is to do. Um, and I found that my I found that my current method is, is really rather aggravating, so I'm going to do something slightly different. Uh, I think and yes, and so this is what I'm doing is basically nipping around the corner. It's just a bit around the way. So this is around the corner from where I was just a moment ago. Uh, I'm just going to murder this guy. Grab these sponges. Right, they're being annoying. They're being very annoying. Oh, I didn't say. Will you just have the good grace to perish? Thank you. Anyway. What I'm going to do... Uh, I've got too much junk on me. Especially now that I've uh, picked those up. I've brought along some signs, and quite frankly, I think I've brought along too many signs now, now that I look at it. Right. And I don't have. Well, actually, tell you what. No, I don't even have enough space to put. I was going to think I could put all my uh, coal into um, this furnace. I need. I could really do with a chest, but I did not bring one with me. Because what I need to do is I need to not just... Um, oh, I know what I'll do. I'll just put these ladders. Stick these ladders to the wall uselessly. That'll free up an inventory slot. Because uh, I'm about to use an invisibility potion. There's no point using an invisibility potion. If you got your armor on, because people can see you. Uh, I still need to throw something away now. Think about it, because I'm going to have to be dealing with wet sponges and dry sponges. Let's chuck away the fish. Chuck it down there, and it will it will disappear. So anyway, I brought a bunch of signs along. Which oh yeah, you can just about see them. I very cleverly did not bring a uh, in. A water breathing potion and the main reason for that is that I brought a, a bought a board I made a new helmet and that helmet happens to have a uh, respiration on it and I thought well you see I don't need water breathing potions I've got a helmet of uh, respiration of course you can't wear your helmet of respiration with invisibility potion or you because you, you're not invisible if they can see your helmet wandering about Apparently they're okay with what the, the the bad guys are okay with watching you wander about like like they're currently seeing an invisible sign. Right, that's what they're seeing. Uh, they're okay with that apparently. But uh, a floating helmet, whoa, that would just give the game away. Can I stand on that? There we go. Okay, so I've made a wall of signs. Um, And I'm just going to use signs to get rid of these last few blocks of water. And that is basically what I'm going to be doing. That, that's my, my, my plan is to block off areas with walls of sign. And remember to, to get a breather every now and then. So this is going to clear up my inventory, isn't it? That's going to be good. Oh, uh, is that okay? So that's now blocked off.
I could do this with other, other blocks, but other blocks have the problem that, that I, I'm not able to walk through them. That's going to uh, cause me difficulties as I. Yes, you know, that they'll actually block me in, and not just the water, which is what I want to be blocked in. Does also have the advantage that uh, they then become like breathing holes. I may have gone from, I have maybe got too many signs with me, to maybe I don't have enough. Uh, admittedly, this is the bit that's got the longest. Oh, ow, 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 breathe, breathe, breathe. This is a, a fairly long span I've got here. Should have got water breathing patients. Now, what this means is. I hope um, that I have a, a much smaller area to have to clear of water. Uh, there we go. Oh, I've missed. Oh, I just hit that with a sponge, actually. Uh, all right. So look. Oh, looks like I've missed some. That's all right. Oh, can't move. Why can't I move? Oh no, I, haven't, I, haven't, I don't think I've... Yeah, that's not me having missed a... There we go! So, oh no, I have missed a sign or two. Uh, where, where, where do I want to go? I want to go... Yeah, and then. There we go. There we go. That's that! I can now. Oh, balls. Oh, that's okay. Didn't understand where that hit came from. Got hit by an axe. Didn't understand where that came from. That's fine. So now I can just pick all those signs up. And that ladder. Which I shall add over here because otherwise it's going to be taking up an inventory slot that I don't particularly feel like taking up. Uh, right, so that that means I've now cleared out an area that that um, much quicker, I think, than what I had to do before. So the question is, can I do that in the main area? Um, right, I've got two stack, two and a bit stacks. Uh, let's. Pop in here so I can breathe. So the question is whether or not I can I can block off this area and thus maybe um, clear out another area. Uh, without having to, you know, because the way I was doing it before was just putting sponges everywhere. There were just too many areas where source blocks could could regenerate. So hopefully, what that this is going to do this is going to wall things off, but not so badly that it's um, it's not going to not not in a difficult way that was gonna, that's going to be hard to. Uh, Put back. So if I, if I was just doing this with blocks, I mean, I, I mean, I think they'll be much more inconvenient. But the question is whether or not I have enough signs to do this. And also, am I going to drown myself in the process by by not paying attention? Well, that's annoying. Am I going to drown myself in, in the process by not paying attention? Uh, well, I hope not. That would be very embarrassing. So how many signs have we got left? I have got ten signs left. So uh, yeah, I'm kind of curious. Is is this going to be easy? Is this actually going to be a quick way of doing it? Um, 
Oh, oh, oh dear. Oh, that was, that was bad. Uh, or is basically the amount of time I saved by. That's not going to help at all, is it? The amount of time I saved by not having to, to place um, sponges because I've got this. this you know, I, I clear up the area very quickly. Is that. Did I just get shot? I just got shot. Um, is that going to be made up for, or is that going to be offset by the amount of time I have to spend putting signs down? Now, I was a bit worried about whether I not wasn't quite sure whether or not I needed to hit up here. Ah, uh, come on, come on. Ah, there we go. See, once I've done once I've done all that that tedious sign putting down, this, then I can clear out an area really quite quickly, which is which is good. I can also start to light things with torches as opposed to. Uh, so that will free up this lot of slides. So I'm using far fewer signs to do, uh, far fewer sponges. Uh, it's just a little more inconvenient when it comes to signs. So, if I can get round there, and then this that corridor is going to be relatively easy, but I think I'll just leave this lot. Although, actually, I think I might want to do that, because then I can have a small number of signs here. Very, oh, I can block all of that corridor off with a very small number of signs. All right, okay. Quickly take your breath. Um, I think that's all I'm going to need to block off this area. Um, there you go. Look at that. Well, I nearly only needed the one um, sponge for that. Because now I can free up all these sides here. And clearing up this lot will be quite easy because this is a very narrow area, so I'm going to leave that for now. So the question is, uh, is it as simple as just dividing up um, Shouldn't really do my pontificating and thinking while I'm in underwater. That's probably a bad idea in general. Uh, yeah, so let's let's have a try and uh, let's, let's try and do a quadrant here. And we'll just duck back into here. Is that oh, I see those are resting on those signs. That's interesting. Well, not resting on them, but that's okay. I may or may not be able to. I may have to be careful when I take these signs down because I think they're interacting with with one another in ways that I'm I'm not immediately. Comprehending. Now, can I do this in the the, the amount I have left of signs? I'll see. You know, when I was um, busily adding, uh, I was I was able to to take down the um, 
the main level oh, breathe, of um, you know, the, of water in the, in the whole thing. Well, that's actually I need to come off. I need to, to, to come off that sign there. There we go. So I was br be able to gradually bring bring the level uh, down a bit, but um, it was really quite annoying, uh, and it took a lot more sponges to do. And I think it was getting harder as I went as I went m as I did more and more and more. It really wasn't that easy. Do I want one more level? I think I do. Not necessarily easy to get to, though. But yes, I did definitely need one more level there. Ah, does that mean I don't have enough? He is beginning to feel that way. So do I, in fact, need to bring the level down in here? Just by general level of... of Let's have a look up here. Well, oh no, I don't want to cut that and get rid of that sign. Ah, da, 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 I can do with about four more signs there to rot. Can I get, oh, I can get them. Right, re oh, I need one more sign. Ah, well, what I'll do is I'll grab a ladder, is what I'll do. Because that was right up against the wall, I can chuck a ladder in there. Wondering where it went. So basically, if I put a ladder there, that should nicely uh, swim, 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 swim. Come on. Right now. So there you go, just a really small number of signs. Oh, a small number of sponges. I've cleared out this area. Now hopefully, there we go. I can now free up all of those signs. Sweet. This doesn't actually leave me very many because um, I seem to need uh, quite a few. One, two, three, four by one, two, three, four. So I need a full stack. Having said that, Having said that, uh, now the difficulty here is you've got the, all that water underneath here, but I should be able to get rid of that no problem. Right, so, same again. Ah, uh, maybe I need. Oh, no, that might not. Uh, I just because I now have to. D I had that little little corner there. Have I just gone visible? I have. Um, uh, let's just grab that for a die. Ha ha! Boy, you were still attacking me, and I was invisible. How dare you! That is against the rules of the game. I'm very upset with you. I'm going to lodge a formal complaint. Right, where were we? Signs. Signs, signs, everywhere a sign. And I'm not, don't have water breathing, and I'm quite vulnerable at the minute, so I should be very careful. So hopefully I'm going to have just enough to get this little coin here. And one more, I hope. Oh, oh no. Alright, I think I'm going to need ladders again. Uh, I'll still need that one. 
Well, technically speaking, I don't need that right there. Grab these. Oh, I've got four of them. That's good. I think that might be what I need for what I'm about to try. I think I just need one more. Or oh, maybe two more. Oh, this is an inconvenient. Um, I could be all right there. Right, and then what I want to do is block off those two. Breathe. And then... Looky, looky. And now this lot is entirely free, so I can grab those. Uh, how many does that make? That makes more than 16. So there you go. I think I now have a method by which I can um, work my way around. Um, in fact, what I think I might do... Is that going to be? Is that going to work? This is definitely. A ch I've got, I need to stop having stopping and having a think while I am underwater. Whoop! That's not what I wanted to do. If I hit that there, there we go. Uh, that water's gone. And so all you're getting is is that flow from. So when I when I come around there and and kill off that section, I'm not going to get flow from there. So that's all I need to do, and I just um, can get this large area by by um, gradually cutting it off with uh, signs. I can then. I can then. Uh, use relatively small numbers of sponges to clear out very large areas. Uh, in fact, I really not sure how many. I do a lot just here, actually. I don't know. I wonder if I can. I wonder if I've got enough to now that I've. I've have I now done enough? That I can just roll it all back. Oh, I, I think I do. I think, in fact, I do have that. I can just... Essentially, the problem was that I had a, a, a circle of um, source blocks. And so every time, you know, there's always places for more source blocks to do. But by cutting, cutting off some of the corners... Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, well, I'll put this last one there. Make sure that's still going strong down here. And now I can just block off that, and I can get back to that later. So I get rid of this. So there's only a few more places, a bit, a few more signs here and there, a few more sponges here and there. And we've nearly got, th ah, there we go, we now have this big area all under control. So that was rather cool. That's a lot of signs I can get back. So while I dismantle everything I've just finished making, uh, I'm going to say thanks so much for watching. Uh, do hit like and subscribe if you're enjoying this video. Come visit Neil Enough Dice at neilenoughdice.com. We're also on Facebook and Twitter, and there are links down uh, in the description on YouTube. And until uh, next time, I'm going to say uh, Dick for Victory. <laughs>